If you would please stand and remove your caps for the playing of the national anthem. Ladies, please, ladies and gentlemen, please join me in the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please be seated. Seniors, good evening, ladies and gentlemen. On behalf of the Harrison County Public School District, I welcome you to the Hilltop and to the Harrison County Athletic Complex for tonight's 71st commencement ceremony, which honors the class of 2021. Through the course of this school year, in-person events have been possible not just because of the efforts of our students and staff, but also because of the support of all of you. In order to properly honor each student, we need your support once more. Please silence your cell phones. Remain seated during the duration of the program. Be mindful of safety protocols and be considerate of all those seated around you. I'm joined on the stage tonight by Harrison County ATC Principal Mark Sims. HCHS counselors Danelle Judy and Allison Earlywine, HCHS assistant principals Jenny Nichols and Todd Brannick, Superintendent Dr. Harry Burchett, and Harrison County Board of Education members Austin Sparks, Ed Taylor, Mary June Brunker, and Ruth Hattrick. Providing tonight's opening remarks will be senior class representative Anna Garrison. Today marks the beginning of a great new chapter for us all, whether we're getting ready to go to college, entering the workforce, or going into the military. Each of our experiences have been unique to us and shaped the paths we've chosen to follow. Each of us will go on to leave our marks in this world. I only hope that we can all come back together at our high school reunion and so celebrate our accomplishments with one another. Gentlemen, please remove your caps as I ask everyone to join me in a prayer. Dear Lord, today we celebrate and give thanks for every student here. Thank you for the friendships we've made and the times we've had together, and for all of those who have helped us along the way. Bless the lives of these graduates with goodness and love. Help them use their gifts wisely, pursue their dreams boldly, and give them and guide them to walk to the future with faith, hope, and great love. Amen. The introduction of the valedictorians and salutatorians will be done now by Assistant Principal Jenny Nichols. Good evening. Every year I have the honor of introducing to you all the graduating class as salutatorian and valedictorian. As I call your name, I would like for you to come forward. This year, the class of 2021 salutatorian is Jensen Sullivan. Thank you. 
This year, we have two valedictorians, Trent Fry, and Ms. Haley Harrington. I think all these kids need a round of applause. Thank you. Our first speaker this evening, representing the Harrison County Board of Education, Austin Sparks. Graduates, family members, faculty, and staff, it is an honor to speak on behalf of the Board of Education and be a part of this celebration for the Harrison County High School class of 2021. It is unbelievably wonderful to get to see everyone in person this year, and it is such a pleasure to share in the emotions filling this stadium as you heard graduating close this chapter on your life story. Parents, you're probably wondering where the years have gone as you marvel at your son's and daughter's accomplishments. It probably doesn't seem too long ago that these young adults we are honoring today were starting their first day of kindergarten. Although living through those years between kindergarten and graduation may have seemed like an eternity for these students and some parents too, this evening is truly an evening to celebrate. Graduates, you are the class of 2021 and are truly a class unlike any other in the history of Harrison County High School. Each graduating class from Harrison County High School is a special class and has overcome a lot of adversity to get to this graduation stage. But your class has overcome challenges that no other, no other class has ever faced. In March of 2020, you started on a journey that will shape the rest of your lives. In these last 14 months, it has been easy to be fearful of what challenges and obstacles are waiting for you around the corner. For you to get to this point shows us how you have faced those fears and the unknowns and conquered them. The strength you have displayed during an unprecedented time in our world is remarkable. I am also a Harrison County graduate and played baseball right down the road here. One of my favorite baseball quotes growing up came from Babe Ruth, never let the fear of striking out keep you from playing the game. As I get further and further from my baseball career, I realize how much that quote applies to day-to-day -to -day life. You have shown that you did not let the fear of adversity get in your way, and in a few moments you're going to walk across this stage, get your diploma, and head to the next stage of your life. Remember that quote and remember how you overcame these last 14 months. So wherever that next game in life is for you, don't let these challenges that face you keep you from playing the game. To all the parents, faculty, and staff members in attendance, from all of us on the Board of Education, we want to say a very heartfelt thank you. None of this is possible without you all this year. You all put in countless hours and added many extra duties to your already long list of responsibilities to make today possible for these students. Graduates, I'm going to ask you to do a little something different tonight. You all are gonna get a countless rounds of applause tonight. So at this time, I'm gonna ask you graduates to give your families, faculty, and staff a round of applause for the hard work they've put in this year. One last comment to you graduates. Make sure to take the time tonight to be proud of what you've accomplished. This was no easy task that you all have gone through this year. These next stages in life will come at you fast. So take the time to enjoy what you have done before the next chapter starts and you're off to accomplish more of your dreams. Thank you all. Senior Class Treasurer, Jalen Terhune. You just graduated. You need, you need a vacation. Thanks for all your patience. 
hands up because we made it. I remember my brother blaring this song by Trinidad James two years ago, the whole month before his graduation. Then I just thought it was funny to see him so excited the last month of his high school career. Now, as I am standing here today, I feel this same excitement to start the next chapter of my life as he did. I will admit I am a little jealous of my brother because two years ago COVID-19 wasn't a thing and he was able to complete his full senior year without any hiccups. Instead, my experience, as well as all of yours, wasn't as magical. I am very thankful for our administration and staff for making this year as normal as they possibly could for us. Now enough talk about this pesky coronavirus. I want to talk about us, class of 2021. I have always considered high school graduation as something in the very far future, even at the beginning of this year. But time flies by and class of 2021, we are graduating today. I know it is still hard for me to comprehend. Our whole education has prepared us for this moment, this ceremony, this departure and each one of us will start a new path once we cross this stage. We will no longer be linked together as one, but as single different people on different journeys. Some of us may become plumbers, construction workers, or even doctors and lawyers. And who knows, Morgan Lunsford may become the next president. Some of our paths may cross in the future, while for others, this may be our last time seeing each other. All in all, I am excited to see what God has in store for each and every one of us. I can't wait for 10 years to see where we will be and who we have developed into as an adult. Class of 2021, I wish you the best of luck and that your future is everything you have hoped it will be. Senior Class Secretary, Bailey Thompson. Good evening. My name is Bailey Thompson and I'm the Class of 2021 Secretary. It is my honor to be standing in front of you tonight, and I feel fortunate to be here. To the class of 2021, I am proud of our resilience throughout school and especially this past year. I could say so much more, but we would be here for too much longer if I did. I believe success depends on your attitude. You can go out in the world every day with a terrible attitude, but you won't get very far. A positive attitude will lead to positive outcomes. A very important woman in my life has always told me, your smile can brighten someone's day, you never know what your effect on people is. You can make a positive or negative impact in the world, and how you decide to influence others is up to you. I encourage you to find something that you're passionate about, and grow through that. Be the best you can be, because success comes to those who give it their all. Be confident in yourself, and don't let anyone tell you your goals are unreachable. Set them and achieve them. Have some fire, be unstoppable, be a force of nature. Always help others and offer kind words to all, even if they may not be reciprocated. Life is about being yourself. It's okay to not always be reaching for more. You are always a winner when you choose to be kind to yourself. Always remember who you are and where you came from. Reflection is not a weakness. It allows you to see how far you have come and reassess when you need it most. Always be true to yourself. Have faith, and may you lean on it and help to help you guide you in life. To those who have supported us, guided us, and educated us, we will never be able to thank you enough for what you have given us. We will always look back on our years of high school and remember your kindness to us. So tonight, I leave you with a quote. Every day, be thankful for the nights that turn into mornings, friends that turn into family, and dreams that turn into reality. Granger Smith.
Senior Class Vice President, Amelia Wadlow. Well, graduates, we did it. As a group, we did indeed start from the very bottom. Now it looks like the whole team's here. Congratulations to all my fellow graduates, their parents and family celebrating with them today. When I look around this graduating class of 2021, I see artists, entrepreneurs, engineers, and Ashton Stone. <laughs> I would like to express my appreciation to all my teachers, friends, and family members who have helped me get to where I am here, standing in front of you all. I would like to specifically thank the administration for being transparent with us and working hard to get us this graduation and as normal of a senior year as possible. Mr. Sims and the teachers of the vocational school who didn't let a pandemic get in the way of our education, the teachers of the high school who have been so patient with us and worked alongside us this year, and lastly, to our families. Thank you for your unconditional love and support. Things might not always go according to plan, but I know we can agree this class is resilient. We've survived a pandemic, for goodness sakes. The fact that we made it here, decorated with these awards and accomplishments, is just a testament to our perseverance and commitment to excellence. Graduates, you are all destined for greatness. Each and every one of you have the potential to change the world. You have all grown into powerful, intellectual individuals who will make a footprint on this earth. Tables turn, bridges burn, you live and you learn, and oftentimes it's the journey that teaches you a lot about your destination. So as we part ways equipped with this priceless knowledge, we embark on a life sure to be filled with challenges and success. Street poet and philosopher Drake once said, oh well, I guess you lose some and you win some as long as the outcome is income. You know I won it all and then some. While the idea of material success does influence our lives heavily, I ask that you follow your dreams and do something that makes you happy. Class, strive to be the best versions of yourself. Thank you. Senior Class President, Justin Smiley. <laughs> Good evening. It is an honor for me to be standing here in front of you all. I want to start out by thanking everyone for coming out and supporting the class of 2021. Right now, this is the moment we've been working for for the past four years. Some of us know what we're doing after graduation. On the other hand, some of us have no clue. So I ask the question now, where do you see yourself in five years? I can see myself graduating from college and working a full-time job. And I'm sure most of you have similar aspirations. We have been used to having someone hold our hand for the last 18 years of our lives. The real world is here now. We have to move on. We've been preparing for this our whole lives. It hasn't always been easy, but we have learned how to work through the challenges and to get through the hard time and overcome the obstacles in our lives. Ladies and gentlemen, it has been a good ride. I wish you all nothing but the best. I hope that everyone goes out and finds what you're looking for in this life. Class of 2021, we did it. At this time, I'd like to invite Assistant Principal Todd Brannick to the podium for the presentation of diplomas by the Harrison County Board of Education.
Row one, please stand. Phoebe Jo Beeson. Draper Lee Pearson, Jr. Talisha Ashanti Adolf. John Bond Alexander. Elizabeth Grace Bishop Allison. Landon Baker. Madison Cheyenne Bennett. Dallas Lee Barrett. Kendall Marie Box. Calvin Baird Bartels. Casey Elizabeth Briarly. Braden Christopher Bell. Kaylin Alexa Faye Bryant. Logan Blake Biddle. Row two, please stand. Mercedes Lynn Chambers. Justin Lee Black. Gabriella Abigail Cisneros. Ian Michael Boland. Rachel Sterling Clifford. Landon Cole Bolin. Taryn Ray Collier. Benton Clay Bramel. Jenna K. Collins. Benjamin Ray Brewer, Jr. Morgan Elizabeth Cooper. Tyler Lynn Kane. Ava Grace Craig. Marshall Charles Canup. Mallory Leanne Creech. Clay Mitchell Carpenter.
Row three, please stand. Emily May Crowther. Isaac Mason Carter. Caden Jace Culberson. Dawson Chase Childress. Tatum Naomi Lynn Cummings. Ethan Michael Klein. Hannah Renee DeLong. Ladarius Martin Connor. Peyton Lee Doyle. Jacob Thomas Cook. Sarah Jean Dunaway. Logan Tate Cummins. Dylan McKenna Eckler. Tayshawn Xavier Lee Custard. Row four, please stand. Elena Desiree Edwards. Alec Carter Davison. McKinley Hope Fain. Derek Lee Dawson. Kendra Elizabeth Fazette. Caleb Jarrett Dickinson. Caitlin Florence. Logan Trent Eversole. Mackenzie Kaylin Franklin. Vincent J. Ferguson. Brooklyn May Fryman. Logan Clay Fortner. Riley Brianne Funkhauser. Trent Jeffrey Fry. Anna Brooke Garrison. Andrew Cole Gallup. Row five, please stand.
Victoria Rennell Gasser. Jason Kendall Gant. Liza Jane Gossett. Justin Dwayne Gauntz. Megan Renee Griffith. Richard Nelson Harris III. Sarah Lynn Halderman. Cameron Clay Harrison. Faith Ann Harney. Alexander Scott Hine. Emma Gabrielle Hedger. Andrew Barry Hodge. Haley Grace Harrington. Colton Hunter Jett. Row six, please stand. Mackenzie Catherine May Hersha. Matthew Connor Kilpola. Skylar Ann Hughes. Brian Glenn Cambrell Jr. Taylor Renee Hunt. Landon Lee Kiscaden. Alina Faye Jones. Ryan Douglas Lawrence. Angel Marie Jones. Blake Allen Lamaster. April Dawn Jones. Benjamin Jacob Lemmings. Haley Marie Jones. Devin Blake Lewis. Madeline Grace Jones. John Nicholas Malone. Row seven, please stand.
Trinice Roberta Kenny. Caden Christopher Mainers. Amber Elaine Kern. Patrick Milton Marshall. Haley Marie Kiskaden. Elhanan Wesley Lane Martin. Madison Marie Kiskaden. Blade Michael Ray Masterson. Jessalyn Nicole Kuntz. Gabriel Logan McNay. Addison Jade Lakes. Gavin McCauley Miller. Hannah Nicole Lewis. Isaac David Miller. Row eight, please stand. Taven Rain Lewis. Jacob Anthony Manier. Morgan Page Lunsford. Isaiah Wallace Morris. Carolina Marty. Jacob Daniel Morris. Margaret Abigail Marier. Tyler Ray Thomas Navarre. Amelia Elizabeth McDaniel. Austin Braden Lane Nichols. Laurel Elizabeth McDaniel. Andrew Scott Nickerson. Brooklyn Elaine McFarland. Jarrett Michael North. Autumn Nicole McLemore. Preston Scott North.
Row nine, please stand. Sarah Elizabeth McCloney. Austin David Pack. Gabriella Maria Messer. Aaron Michael Pickett. Madison Taylor Mink. Harold Joseph Pike III. Emma Nicole Moore. Chandler Cole Power. Sarah Beth Newman. Chase Nathaniel Reed. Lily Danielle Nickerson. Ryan Donald Ripley. Kaylee Brooke Northcutt. Yahir Rivera Menchaca. Row 10, please stand. Keelan Greer Northcutt. Dakota Connor Roberts. Shania Fay Pack. Carson Dean Roberts. Molly Paige Perkins. Alan Daniel Roquet. <laughs> Emily Elizabeth. Persinger, Brian Nicholas Royalty, Raven Nicole Price, Javier David Sexton, Emma Catherine Ratliff. Perseus Joshua Nathaniel Sexton. Jessica Lauren Rayburn. Justin Keith Smiley.
Chloe Ann Root. James David Lee Casey Sword. Row 11, please stand. Taylor Ross. Taylor Brooke Ross. Ashton Trey Stone. Jaden Hannah Shaw. Caden Ray Streitenberger. Cassidy Ruth Snap. James Dean Sumner. Shelby Renee Stanfield. Jacob Alexander Lee Taylor. Jensen Elizabeth Sullivan. Jude Thomas Thompson. Raven Allen Sullivan. Tristan James Thompson. Kennedy Noel Sumter. Dylan Tennessee Turner. Row 12, please stand. <laughs> Alexis Faith Schweitzer. Riley Scott Warmoth. Emma Louise Tackett. Ricky, Ricky Adam Wellman. Jalen Sage Terhune. Tavon Hakeem Demond Williams. <laughs> Bailey Nicole Thompson.
Bryce Aaron Zumwalt. Josie May Vaughn. Amelia Grace Wadalo. Kelsey Ray Wigglesworth. And now that moment, years in the making, conferring diplomas, Superintendent of Harrison County Public Schools, Dr. Harry Burchett. Thank you, Mr. Fowler. And now seniors, the class of 2021, Harrison County High School, the moment that you've all been waiting for. With the powers vested in me by the Commonwealth of Kentucky, and the Harrison County Board of Education, I now pronounce you graduates. Closing remarks will now be provided by Anna Garrison. In the words of St. Ignatius of Loyola, go forth and set the world on fire. So do just that. May your flame burn bright. We've got our whole lives ahead of us. Don't let a single moment pass by. High school seemed like it ended in the blink of an eye but I can't wait to see what the future holds for us all. Congratulations, you guys, we did it! Congratulations to all of our graduates and their families. At the close of tonight's ceremony, the graduates will return to the high school where they will receive their official school documentation we invite our guests at your discretion to join the graduate at Ingle Stadium for post-event photos. We do ask that once again, you be mindful of safety protocols. A reminder to our graduates, Project Grad takes place at five o'clock tomorrow night here at the Athletic Complex. And an announcement to everyone, please be following Harrison County School's social media for information concerning the pickup of the official graduation photo class composite, and graduation DVD. As we close tonight, I'd like to thank Dr. Miller and Wedco for working with us to establish a plan for this ceremony, the Harrison County Board of Education for always ensuring that opportunities are provided to our students, to our district maintenance and custodial staff who assisted Jamie Posey and Jenny Nichols in arranging tonight's venue, to our community who continues to support our young people. And finally, to our students, especially the class of 21, I thank you for your patience, for your understanding, and for your perseverance. Congratulations.
graduates. Are you ready to step in when our time comes? Yeah. Oh, he remembers it. Come in. Mark. 